physical or digital? Physical or digital? Physical or digital? FDG Entertainment is letting you decide. What's up, everybody? It's Zach from Switch Force. The fun little update. The upcoming Switch title, Monster Boy and the Cursed Kingdom. Not to be confused with Wonder Boy, the Dragon's Trap, releasing on April 18th for Switch. But Monster Boy and the Cursed Kingdom from FDG Entertainment is having a poll over on Twitter to see if they should make this a physical release as well. Currently, it's a digital indie title, but they're looking at bringing out a cartridge in box for the game. And I thought this was such a cool way for a company, a developer, a publisher to interact with their fan base and let the Switch owners, the Switch user base, determine whether or not this game reaches its cartridge final form. And we have talked much uh, on this channel about digital or physical, and if we like the cool little cartridges, or if we'd rather have everything just loaded up onto a micro SD, and after a whole lot of hemming and hawing, I personally fall on the side of loving the physical cartridges. I really enjoy having some games on my Switch just just natively, like on an SD card, but I like the little cartridge. I love the little Binding of Isaac Afterbirth cart, and I love the Legend of Zelda cart, and I love having just a, a whole smorgasbord of all these little physical pieces of media, plus the game cases are so cool, and especially with Binding of Isaac from an, an indie dev, they went all out and gave you some extras, like a little, little instruction manual, some stickers, reversible cover art. So, for another indie title here, Monster Boy and the Cursed Kingdom, no clue if it'll be as enjoyable as Isaac gameplay-wise, but looks like they're prepping a really cool case, and I'd love to see more indie titles hit physical. So if that's something you feel strongly about, they are looking for you to like their tweet. I'll put a link in the description. You can go check it out. Uh, and again, just a really, really nifty way for FDG to gauge their audience's interest and put their next move in the hands of the fans, which I thought was super cool. So let us know which way you're going to be voting, uh, or if you're interested at all in Monster Boy and the Cursed Kingdom, or if you're more a Wonder Boy, the Dragon's Trap fan. I think it's funny that both of these uh, are sort of remakes from a similar origin franchise, and they're both coming out on Switch, and they're both coming out this year. Very, very interesting. I'm looking forward to playing Wonder Boy. I know more about that one, releasing, like I said, April 18th. But now that this Monster Boy in the Cursed Kingdom is getting a physical release, or could get a physical release, I don't know. That has definitely piqued my interest. So let me know what you guys think as well. I just thought this was a cool uh, little feel-good story for the day. Until next time, everybody, a fantastic day. Don't forget to subscribe to stay up to date on the latest and greatest from Switch and all sorts of cool announcements like this one. Hit that notification bell so you can get it right when the news hits. Until then, though, everybody, thanks again. Have a fantastic day. Switch Force out.